sheep are gone astray. Every man doing what he wants, forgetting to keep the commandments of God. Holy Sadodo, Holy Sadodo, Dodo, Dodo. Ikonamu, Bayanamu, Sadodo. Forgiveness, Lord. I have come with a remorse for my father. Please forgive me, my father. I am sorry, oh. Holy Sado. Daddy, I am sorry, eh. Holy Sado, Holy Sado, Holy Sado, Dodo. Holy Sado, Holy Sado, Holy Sado. Wash me clean, Lord. Do not look upon my sins anymore. Sometimes I go astray. I need you, Lord, to correct my path, to lead me down the to do your will, to do your will, and only your will. I don't want to sin anymore. I don't want. I don't want to do those things you don't want, Papa. Give me the strength to practice your gospel, Daddy. My father, I am sorry. My father, I am sorry. My father, I am sorry. Hey, 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 hey. I'm sorry, Lord, for all the things I've done. Please forgive me. I'm your man, Edmunds. Thank you, Father.
heart broken, but I was thing that made me strong the pain. I was down, you raised me up and hungry, you fed me and set me on high. Lord, I was blind, you restored my sight. Hopeless and helpless, you came to my rescue. Was lost in the world, you found me and remolded me. A mess and my hope was lost. You came to me and gave me hope and zeal to carry on. I was in a salusa man, but I loved you, made me a winner man. Day after day, they call me a minor case, but Lord, you made me a major case. Search, Papa, you were my God. From age to age and time to time, you remain the same. I say, the last time I checked and made my findings, Papa, you were my God. Just today, today, tomorrow, and forever, you remain. Not the answer. Oh. All peace, all number is the answer. I tell you. All peace, all number is the answer. This is not true. All peace, all number is the answer. World peace, world peace, world peace, all number is the answer. My God, all about is the answer. No matter the inventions, no matter the security, no matter the security, no matter the government, no matter the world peace to us, but only God, with the means of His kingdom, can bring peace to the world. I tell you. Of our truth, all peace, all love is the answer. I tell you, all peace, all love is the answer. 
astronomers, scientists, magicians, cannot offer peace to you. Brother, can you hear me? Even the money you have in the bank can not afford peace to you. The gas you have cannot afford peace to you. The houses you have cannot afford peace to you. I mean the asset you have can never, never afford peace to you. Only Olumba, only Olumba, can give you peace, I tell you.
Cross and Star, also known as the Christ Universal Spiritual School of Practical Christianity, is the new kingdom of God on earth, which was revealed to Prophet Daniel in the book of Daniel chapter 2 verse 44. Brotherhood of the Cross and Star is the biblical proverbial mustard seed, whose insignificant genesis in Biakman land, a backwater village in the remotest area of Cross River State of Nigeria, has metamorphosed into a universal movement with the highest spiritual magnitude made possible by its tenacity, truthful consistency, and the charismatic personality of the founder and leader Olumba Olumba Obu. Brotherhood of the Cross and Star is not a I believe in the immense power of His Holiness Olumba Welcome to this wonderful program, The Prayer Line, a special moment with the Holy Father. I am Uduak Abadok. This is a program that, that avails to the children of God the opportunity to receive instant counseling, instant healing, instant visions, instant prayers to your different problems, be it spiritual or physical. You could reach us via our Starcross Television International YouTube channel, or you could call us via the number displayed on your screen. We'll take a brief break, and when we return, I'll introduce our guest here with me in the studio. And of course, the topic of discuss for tonight. So don't go anywhere. We'll be right back shortly. I believe in the name and power of His Holiness on Welcome back, beloved viewer. If you're just joining us, you're joining at the right time. This is the program, The Prayer Line, a special moment with the Holy Father. With me here in the studio is Picture Christ of Ed Mesha Kukun. You're welcome. Thank you very much. Also with me here is Divine Vanguard Brother Daniel Egon. You're welcome. Thank you. All right. So, beloved viewer, today our topic is the power in the new name of God, Olumba, Olumba, Obu. I'll take that again. The power in the new name of God, Olumba, Olumba, Obu. Or we could say the power in the new name of God, O, O, O. So, beloved viewer, this is what we're going to be discussing about tonight. So, please, before we get started, we're going to take an opening prayer to invite the Holy Spirit to come and lead and direct us because we're talking about the new name of God. So we need his divine inspiration. He needs to reveal these things to us, those hidden things to us, because we are just mere tools in his hands. So please, Brother Daniel, lead us in an opening prayer. Oh. <laughs> Oh, 
foundation cana u cana de o i i e ye ne rum ba ba du du ke me ken di bia du ba mu tu Let all thanks and praises, power, dominion, authority be given to God Almighty, the maker of the universe. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Let thanks and praises, power, dominion, authority, supremacy be given to God Almighty, the light of the world, in the blood of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Let all that is pure, perfect, and praiseworthy be accorded to the Lamb of God that sits on the throne of perfection, judging the twelve type of Israel. Great leader Olumba Olumba Ogu. And this Christ, the first begotten Son of Righteousness, the Prince of Peace, the King of Kings and Lord of Lords, His Holiness, Lumba, Lumba, we be now and forevermore. Amen. Holy, 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 Father. holy is the name, the perfect Master. Holy is the name, the super sure foundation, the truth, the way and the life. We thank thee, Lord of heaven and earth, for your wonderful love upon humanity. We thank you, mighty Father, for the forgiveness of our sins. We thank you for a holy Thursday we have consecrated. Thank you, mighty Father, for giving us hope. Thank you, mighty Father, for the peace of mind you have given entire brotherhood. Thank you, mighty Father, for the spirit of safety. Thank you, mighty Father, for your protection all over the universe in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Thank you, most holy and everlasting Father, from, from generation to generation, you are God and you remain the same. And beside you, there is none, there is no one like you, great spirit of Lumba, in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Thank you, mighty Father, for the foundation you laid with the blood of our Lord Jesus Christ Amen. to save the whole world. Uh, for, for, for the redemption plan that when we believe on that name our Lord Jesus Christ will be saved and you have come with a new name Olumba Olumba who the fighter the fighter the conqueror thank you for conquering for all your children in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ Amen. thank you for disgracing all satanic spirit principalities and powers rulers of the darkness of this world witches and wizards wicked spirit forces thank you for making a show of them in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ Amen. thank you for giving them final rubbish against their children those who plan evil against their children Lord of heaven and earth thank you for disgracing them all in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ Amen. thank you mighty father this day all those who call you the names of your children in different altars thank you mighty father for you have used your everlasting fire to burn all of them wherever they are Amen. all those wicked spirit forces that go to junction and do assignment all those who call your name in Illuminati Call the name, the name of the children of God in, in different temples, satanic temple, in all bony confraternity, all the wicked confraternity in the universe. Thank you for scattering them wherever they are in the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. You are giving us the power to trample upon serpents and scorpions, and nothing shall by any means hurt us. Amen. Thank you, mighty Father, for the power you have put inside your name. That when we call the name, oh, 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 principalities and powers bow down, satanic spirit bow down. Rulers of this of the darkness of this world, bow down. Thank you, mighty Father, for the peace your name is giving the whole world. Thank you, most honorable everlasting Father, for using this program to give joy to those who do not have joy, to open the way where all the ways of your children are blocked. Thank you for using this program to open their ways in the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you for giving joy. Thank you, mighty Father, for manifesting as a great light to dispel darkness perpetually, now and even forevermore. Amen. And all things are honorable to the great spirit that lead the universe in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. That honor and glory be to the, the truth, the master perfectionist, the one who has come to salvage mankind, his holiness, Lumba, Lumba, in the blood of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Let honor and glory be to the King of kings and the Lord of lords, the light of, that shines the universe, and darkness cannot comprehend his holiness. Lumba, Lumba, we be now and forevermore. Amen. Amen. Thank, Thank you so God. much, Brother Daniel, for that. Wonderful prayer. All right, beloved people, we're going to have uh, this discussion session for about 30 minutes, after which our phone line to be open for you to call us. So, beloved people, the essence of our topic tonight, the power in the new name of God, Olumba, Olumba, Obu, is just to expand our understanding on the potency of the name O, O, O. No one definitely knows God. No one can describe what God looks like, how powerful he is, except he reveals himself unto you. So tonight, we would love you to call us and share with us how you have applied this new name and how it has worked for you. We need those testimonies. We know there are lots of us out there that has called the Father in different situations at different places. We called on this name, Olumba, Olumba, Obo, and the Father came through for us. So we would love you to share those testimonies with our beloved viewers so that they can understand 
the potency in this new name of God, Olumba, Olumba, Obo. So with that said and done, we're going to um, start by establishing an understanding, Brother Daniel. It is said that God is all in all. If so, why should God have a name? In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. In the blood of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Now and even forevermore. Amen. You see, the Bible says, Address no man on earth as leader, for one is your leader, who is God Almighty. Address no man on earth as master, for one is your master, who is Christ. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Now, if God is the leader, and he has given authority to Adam to give names to all his creations, then the leader himself must have a name. Even the word leader is said is a name in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. So the actual name of God is leader. Because no man on earth is permitted to lead. If you call yourself a leader anywhere, you are blaspheming against God. We are all followers to his that's why it's called the spirit of truth. Nobody or the Bible says, let God be true and men, let God be true and let all men be liars. So he is the he is the one that leads, that is leading man to the accurate knowledge of truth. Therefore, he is called leader. That is the best name you can call God in the name of Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. So, God is called uh, in different names: Jehovah, Jehovah Nissi, Jehovah Shama, Jehovah Sikenu, Jehovah Elohika. The Lord my healer is my helper. All those attributes are the names they used to describe him. But in this generation, he has choose to to be called Olumba. Olu means what? Umba means the whole war. And then you can call him fighter, the fighter, the conqueror. Or boom is conqueror. You can call him king. And no one on earth is the king. He's only the king of kings and lord of lords. So you can call him Lord. You can, you can read his name there in the book of Exodus chapter 17. Let's see. Open Exodus chapter 17. His attributes, Jehovah. That is how. The, the, his former name is Jehovah, but the Lumba made us understand Jehovah is the name of an angel. The real name of God is Lumba Lumba Ubum. Exodus chapter 17, verse 15. verse 15 says and Moses built an altar and called its name the Lord is my banner for he said because the Lord has sworn the Lord will have war with Amalek from generation to generation yes we some people say his banner over me is love so one of the names of God is love if you want to describe the name of God he is expressly seen in all the attributes that describe him for instance, we call, we call him God of peace. Who, is, who can give peace? He's God. You call him God of love. They just celebrated the power of love. Who did they celebrate? His holiness, Lumba, Lumba, Boom. You come and bear love now. Nobody is permitted to bear love because man cannot express love. The love that man expresses is fake. He's the only one that expresses true and real love. You call him the God of truth. That's why he's called, he, lead, he shall lead man to the accurate knowledge of truth. All men in the universe are liars. All most of the worldly pastors are all liars. The only person that tells us the truth and acts the truth is God Almighty Himself. And we have come to see Him. We have seen Him face to face on earth. And He teaches us. And His character, His humility reflects His true nature. So if you want to see God, see God in His attribute. Peace, righteousness, holiness, purity, salvation. He has the power to save. Who can save? Isaiah chapter 60, the Bible says, Who is this that cometh from Edom? We died garment from Bozra. This that is glorious in his apparel, traveling in the greatness of his strength. Then the, the, the prophet now asks, Why is your apparel red? Read Isaiah chapter 63, verse 1 to 5. And I say, I am the one that treads in the fierceness of the wrath of the Almighty God. I am the one mighty to save. That's why he's called the Savior. And why does he come from Edom this time around? Isaiah 63, verse 1 to 5. Yeah. Salvation. Isaiah 63, Salvation is here. Yeah, verse 1 to, to 5. 5 yeah. Who is this who comes from Edom with dyed garments from Bozrah? Yeah. This one who is glorious in his apparel, traveling in the greatness of his strength. Mm -hmm. I who speak in righteousness, mighty to save. Why is your apparel red and your garments 
like one who treads in the winepress. I have trodden the winepress alone, and from the people no one was with me, for I have trodden them in my anger and trampled them in my fury. Their blood is sprinkled upon my garments, and I have stained all my robes. For the day of vengeance is in my heart, and the year of my redeemed has come. I looked, but there was no one to help, and I wondered that there was no one to uphold. Therefore my own arm brought salvation for me, and my own fury, is sus it sustained me. The, the summary of this reading is salvation. He is called Savior. That was why in his first advent he came as Christ, our Lord Jesus Christ. Uh, they say, he shall be called Jesus, for he shall save his, his, his people from their sins. And then Christ is the anointed one. Jesus Christ means the anointed Savior. Now in the regeneration, he has come in the black race. Esau is Edom, Genesis 36 verse 8. Esau is Edom, and then he manifests in the Gentiles with a new name. That new name he's talking about in the book of Revelation chapter 3 verse 12. Revelation chapter 2 verse 17, that new name, anything new in my new name, if you hear him describe my new name, what makes it new? It will not be in the New Testament, it will not be in the Old Testament, that is why it is new. Something cannot be new until when it is newly introduced, that is why we cannot be, everybody is perplexed, uh, but it's not here, it's not here. that is why it is new, in the name of Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. So his actual name is Savior, that is the best name you can call God, because no man can save but God. Amen. Thank you so much for that elaborate explanation. All right, so please, uh, Brother Meshach, why should God have a name? In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. In the blood of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Now and forevermore. Amen. I may not be able to explain more deeper because it has to do with God. Um, um, when I was... Um, I won the one for four. And one time in the Virgin Academy, we were taught that all the names and title that is given to God is given to him because of his work. Because he has been able to fulfill everything he said he would do. And he has done it all. And then his place that is sitting, no man can share that glory in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. God needed a name for his children to be able to recognize him, for his children to be able to call him. We needed a, something to attach to God that whenever we call him, even the, 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 the spirit of darkness will know that we are calling a supernatural in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Now, one thing is a name. A name is defined as the personality of anybody and the power and authority is given to any other person. For example, if you go to South America, you see some people bearing Jesus. In Israel and the rest, see people have, having a name called Jesus. I was in Biagban. I've seen people answering Olumba. Anybody can answer all this name. But there is a name that nobody can answer, God. God, nobody can answer that name. Now, if I'm talking to, in any way I mention Udwak Abado, any other person in your place can answer the same name with the last surname. But who has the, who I'm talking about, may not be that one in the village. It may not be that one in the other place. Is, is the one I'm talking about is the one that carried the, the power. Anybody can say his name is Jesus Christ. He can answer the complete name, Jesus Christ. But who I am talking about is the one that has the dominion. The, the power, the glory, the personality. In Biakban, anybody can answer Olumba. But I'm talking about the one that can give a dead body life. The one that can give the body that is so weak is down life. Now, the importance of God having a name 
was so that if I'm down, I can call him to come up and rescue me. I needed something to have faith on. I needed something that I can call that will play the role of a supernatural in my body, in my life. I needed a name that I can call. A miracle will happen. So, a lot of people can say they are, they are Jesus, but there is Jesus Christ who can give life. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. So, whatever you have to, to, to know to know today, listen to me. Whatever you have to get today is to understand that God is not just having a name, Jehovah, uh, whatever you can call him. I am, I am that I am, the beginning and the end, for nothing. He does not really need names, but we need something to call. We need something to call. The only time God said, said something, he said, I am that I am. And the people said, this is his name. I am that I am. All the names that you see, or like I am the beginning and the end. They are not angels that are giving the name. He called himself who he is. When you come to Brotherhood of the Cross and start today, nobody among the graduate or whatever the bishop that have said, let's look at the portrait of the Dalumba Olumba Bu. He's so powerful, let's give him a name. And he said, let's call him Olumba, Olumba, Obu. Nobody. He said that I am Olumba, Olumba, Obu. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. And some time ago, in one of the mega events, His Holiness Olumba, Olumba, Obu, stand and said, I was in the beginning. I will control till the end. I will save you till the end. I challenge all the church leaders. If they have power, let them put in their name. I have put power in my name. Even our Lord Jesus Christ has put power in his name. He said, if you call the Lord Jesus Christ, you have what you want. And if you call it Alumba Alumba, he said, oh, oh, oh. In any way, he said, whatever you want, you have it. Now, these are not, have you ever seen angels say, let's plan and give him a name? No, he has given himself names. And why did he give himself name? It's because we, the children of God, we really needed something to call. In the Bible, he said, this sign shall follow them that believe in my name. That means he has a name that we should call. Today, a lot of people answer the same name that God has. A lot of people answer the same name that God has. But when you see as they call Jesus Christ, or they call, oh, God of Abraham, or God of Moses, I am that I am. They are not divine to a man. They are not calling man. They are not calling Moses. We are not talking about Elijah, however you are powerful, there is, this, there is a direction. Everybody believing in the name of God, there is a direction. If we, sometimes people say, it is only God that can do this. That is, there are certain things that men cannot really do. So, the father came in with a name. This name is not that it's compulsory that he must answer. It's not compulsory that he must answer. But he came in to tell me that this is the name that you have to call when you are sick. The fishes in the water may not know him as Alpha and Omega. Fishes may be calling him something else, but he's answering them. The animals in the forest may be calling, the, the, may be calling him the only light of the world, and he's answering them. Men will be calling him Olumba, Olumba, Bo, Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end and the rest. He will still answer. He has thousands of names. And all these names have the same power. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. All the names have the same power. Okay, quickly, open to this portion of the Bible I've selected out from the Bible. Um, Colossians. Um, uh, let's see chapter 2, verses 9 to 15. Colossians 
Ephesians chapter 2, verse 9 to 15. For in him dwells all the fullness of the Godhead bodily, and you are complete in him who is the head of all principality and power. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Hold on a bit there. You see, Father is the head of every occultist. Occultic, every powers. He is the head. Now, if I was having problem in the kingdom of Satan, mm -hmm. they have arrested me, for example, the father is the head there. I fear not. God is the head. Are you hearing me? If they have put poison for you in a certain way to die, God is the head of death. Fear not. He is there. Without his name, nothing can happen. You can't stand like this and without the name, you can't talk to God. Because when you, you call the name of the father, the, the name of the Father gives a direction to connection. You connect to Him when you mention His name. Is when you connect to Him. So if you if you if you stand holding the, the Bible and look at the Bible and believe that God will connect to you, you are a liar. You must call Him in the name that you know. What if I the brother was thinking, but this is said, call the name that you know, put it in prayer, that your prayer may be working. A whole lot of people today in this physical realm, in this world, have never one day. 99% of the people presently have not been able to make use of the name. It's far bigger than saying, in my, uh, thank you. The tools is a complete tools. It's a system. It's, it's, you must make, 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 use, make use of the name to be able to get what you want. So the name is not just because of, hey, God is there. Let's, let's, let's believe God is there. There is something that will give you faith. And there is something that you must call, do, in the name of God to walk. That is to believe in the name and to be able to call the name in the right way. When are you calling? How, what are you calling it for? What do you want that makes you call the name of the Father? Okay. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Thank you so much. We're actually going to get to that point where we get to explain when we should call the name and how we should call the name of God. But for now, let us understand why the new name of God, Olumba Olumba Obo, is powerful. Please, Father Daniel. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. In the blood of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Now and forevermore. Amen. Um, we are talking about power. We we'll go to First Corinthians chapter four, verse twenty. The, the scripture says, "For the kingdom of God is not in word." No. Okay. For the kingdom of God is not in word, but it's in power. Then, who is this kingdom of God? The kingdom of God is our Lord Jesus Christ. The kingdom of God is leader Olumba Olumba Obo. Amen. The kingdom of God is His Holiness Olumba Olumba Obo. Mm -hmm. And then the the weird power. This this entity is power personified. That is why in any in in the midst of confession, you say Great Spirit Olumba, and then you see signs following. When I was in NYSC, I keep giving this testimony because. I was frustrated. They wanted me to go back to Calabar. I should not wear my NYS uniform because I did not come with a uh, university degree. I just kept quiet. I said, in my mind, I said, Great Spirit Olumba. Great Spirit Olumba. Great Spirit Olumba. Before I knew it, the, the coordinator who was uh, clearing people for NYS kit said, give me, give me your documents. I gave him my documents. He checked. He saw one document that the tallies with the University of Calabar, the registrar, and he cleared me. This is somebody who said, that I, I, if you don't come with uh, any certificate, and I think, how can I come from Calabar and reach Platinum State and then go back to one? Then what would I tell my father? Secondly, I told the father, Papa, please, as I'm going to NYSC, eh, give me at least one person to baptize. And as God may have it, he gave me a born again. These people that speak in tongues seriously, that believe that Jesus is coming from the sky. 
how they did it because there I was uh, the family doctor. I was in the midst of the born again. If I want to pray, somebody is sick in the form of maybe shivering and they severely sick, I will just go in. They won't even know what I'm saying. So I say, by the power and authority of Olumba Olumba, by commanding Siva to get out of this body, they will not even know. I will not even say it. So I came to discover that what you say inside is more even powerful than what you make people to hear. So before I know, before I even put the injection to draw blood, you see the person getting stronger. So they will not say, no, uh, Copper Daniel, the man of God that God is currently using in the house. So that thing gave Father so much uh, glory. God, they will ask me, where is chapel of church is this? I say it's Olumba. Is this seller? They know it's Olumba, Olumba, Obum. So the name of Olumba has power. What about in, well, in the college when I was in a, a, a Ketika? There was no food, nothing, nothing. In my heart, I say, oh, Papa Olumba, how can I be in your palace and I'm hungry? The following day, a woman brought a very big bag of rice. Then that day, I, I was shocked. And a bag of salt, and there was no salt, there was nothing. That was the day I started to fear. See, this place is not an ordinary place. How can I say something inside my mind? And I'm seeing the reaction in the name of Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. So I really see you don't even need you don't even need to fear. You are in the right place where you call Olumba. Olu, the word. Mba, the whole world. The word of the whole world. So when I go on evangelism, I tell people, stop being afraid of calling the name. Or what people people tell you. Because if you like. I don't even give him all the name, he does not care. He's still doing, he's still walking. But the Bible says, for my father walking, he gets when I walk. So it does not concern me how you call him. What he's still doing is work gradually. So just believe. I explained to him the name of Olumba is a strong tower. Proverbs chapter 18, verse 10. The name of the Lord is a strong tower, and the righteous run into it and are saved. So the name of Olumba is a strong tower. The righteous run into it and are saved. Salvation. That's why I like this song. Every living soul praise the Holy One. Every living soul praise the Holy One. For He has made us to see a new day of joy. He has made us to see a new day of Because if He was not God Almighty, especially some people like us, they would have finished our sins in you know, our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. So He is. The other time, I asked him, Papa, who is this Prince of? Who is this Prince of this world? I was saying that inside my mind. Say, Grace be for Lumba. Who is this prince of this world? What the Bible says, the prince of this world come and has nothing in me. I was worried. Before I knew what was happening, in one Sunday, the father was preaching. And I said, Today, you are going to know who is the prince of this world. That was this. another time he, he showed me that even if you say anything in the secret in his name, Olumba Olumba will hear it. Enough, Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. So it doesn't matter where you are. If you not be in the high, in the in the remotest part of the world, as far as you are you are keeping your feet on this earth, as far as you are still breathing, Olumba is standing by your side. You know, Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. So I have had so many encounters that made me to know that calling his name, even inside your heart without even saying anything, he's hearing. So it's a very it's not a human being. The father is not the person you are seeing here is not a human being at all. It's just it's just a, just carrying human body to just is more than what we are seeing him in the name of Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. So there is too much power, so much anointing in his name. Now I even forever. Amen. Thank you very much for that, please, Brother Mesha. Why is a new name Olumba Olumba Opo powerful? Anybody outside there knows this. Anybody. Especially those uh, sisters that have been into serious warfare. Those businessmen, uh, those are brothers who came out from serious family. Anybody that is alive today in this very kingdom knows the reason why the father is so powerful. The name O O O. If you go to village today, you will see old women who are 1900 of age using the, the charcoal to write on their door. It's not, a, it's, it's, it's not even a signature. It's not a logo of, the, of, the, of this kingdom. But how come we, we, it's so powerful? You ask them. Men, women that give, that, that give to bed, that put to bed in the labor room, 
ask them how far the, the, the name you call last for the baby to come out. As those who operate in the healing homes. It's so powerful. It's not a question that I can answer for one minute. It's so, so powerful. A man that is so sick, taken to the hospital. Doctor said the body cannot, re uh, uh, cannot uh, respond to treatment. Because of the evil attack. Facing the physical body. Even the ordinary drip cannot enter. But it's moving away from the hospital to the healing home. A carbon biscuit and banana. Call him the name of the father. He's taking away that sickness. Who is in that place should tell how powerful the name OOO is. Yes. The one taken to prison, taken to, this, to the God, about to be taken to prison. The day of judgment, he's standing like this, meditating, calling the new name of God. The, 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 the judgment fell for him. Yes. The case turned to his own favor. The man who the, 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 the thief judge said, you have been discharged and acquitted, should explain what he experienced in the name of the father. The one that is seen dead already, on a sick bed, seen dead, no solution. A word from the morning prayer from his holy day, Solumba Lumba said, Go, I am well. I mean, go, all is well. He's not referring to one person who is on the sick bed. He's not referring to the one that is in the farm. He's not referring to the one that is in the hospital. He's not referring to the one that is down. He's not referring to the one that is sound. He just say it generally. Yes. The word is they explain, they divide themselves. Yes going to the people that are calling him, calling him at the same time, entering, and the one that is waking up from the sick bed should be able to explain. It's a question for everybody in Brotherhood of the Cross and Star. The people, the people in America should be able to answer at this point. Yes. What is the name of the Dalumba Lumba book? How powerful it is because I'm about to speak now in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. The Father name is so powerful that it generated water. Man can never be able to tell. No, no scientist can explain what is water. Just common water sprinkling on the body that is so hot. All form of tablet has been given, injection has been given, but if a child take a water, ordinary water that I can fish, you can fish, sprinkling on the body and the sickness go away. It's so powerful is that that, that dangerous things is in the front. You stop the car. Yes. Yeah. You try everything until the, the danger Christ. is out before the car start alone. When you are stranded on the road, stand and wait at the midnight, you see a new car driving in. Yes. Somebody is inside asking you, where are you going to? Come, let me take you. And the person stops you at exactly where you are. And you remove money to give. He said, no. Olumba is powerful. That is the same man who Moses hears his voice, his voice in the burning bush. We are not talking about Moses here. We are not talking about Abraham. He's so powerful. That a sister traveled from Calabar to Lagos and got accident on the road and died. He was taken to a mutual. He was inside. And a man came to the vestry and said, Father, a sister that came to, for, for the work of God died on the road. He's taken to the hospital. Mutual said, go and, go and bring her out. And the moment that they wanted to bring a woman out of a freezer, she was already hitting the freezer to come out. Life-giving spirit. Yes. Is it a lumbar? Olumba Ubu. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. He came in the body of man. But his name is so powerful. This is the man who when he was a baby, a bed, a bed on his way. What happened? Defecated on his shoulder. On his on his body. And a lot of people started laughing and the bed came back to apologize. This is not just body and flesh. It's so powerful. That when we place him on our door as a local, whatever we place it, we take a sticker. You, you, you don't matter. When, whenever you take the name, you take a chalk, whether it is a stone, when once you write, oh, it could stand for nothing. It could stand for your name. But when you write, oh, again, it could still stand for your name. It could stand for any other thing. But if it is complete, oh, 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 it stands for power. 
the wicked angels will come in there, come around that place. Fire will spark and they will fear. The name of the Father can pop out. It's a, it's a, it is a, it's a name that can pop out. It can move out of the door that you write it at Chakun and become so powerful and protect the door. It's a sign by your door. It's a sign on your car that accident and robbers, things like that has no dominion over you. We wear it on our body. He said the new name of God, he said, he said, he said, will be written up upon your body. It's so powerful. When you see us, people are dying here, calling upon his name. Everybody's dying, calling upon his name. Everybody love the name. Everybody's chasing the name. Everybody want to carry the name. Every, so many people are looking for how to hijack it mm. and take it home. If, come, if, if you go to 34 Ambo today, right now, everybody's still looking at the name. How many people have it in the house? How many people believe? If you believe in the name, of course, you know, those who believe in the name, the, the name is a tool. You know, it's a tool that work miracles. If I have called that name first time, he refused to answer me. I called the second time, he refused to answer me. I called the third time, he refused to answer me. I would have been in my father's house now, worshiping another thing. And the same thing with every other person. But when once you say, oh, 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 because ah. power, I've already been put into the name. Yeah. He makes me die here. They said, Meshach, you are worshipping man. I said, don't worry. You will not be able to, to understand, to get, or to explain. I can't explain to you yeah. why I am still you here. Don't understand. I can't explain to you why I am still here. He has never failed me for once. You understand me? Never. A lot of people, stranded women, they would have died. A lot of people. Being in the hospital, taking away from psychiatric homes, you know, running away from life. Yeah. And they're coming to him and they have rest. If I have called his name, he did not answer me. I would not be here talking about the name. But I'm telling you that I can explain. I cannot, I cannot really explain how powerful it is. It's the solid rock. It's the name that can save life. It's the name that we all need. I, when they said you are worshipping man, they don't know what they say. They don't know what they say. When they say you don't know what you are doing in Brotherhood of the Cross and stuff, anyone that says that to me, I said, look, you are stupid. You don't know what you are saying because what you say that is not God is giving me life, is protecting me. I am the one shining today because of him. Oh, God, I wish the eyes of everybody. No wonder he said I will come in the night like a thief. Yes. Let me not talk again. Now I'm forever. Amen. <laughs> Thank you so much for that. All right, beloved, we will take a short break and when we return, our phone line to be open. Please call us and share with us your testimony on the new name of God, Olumba, Olumba, Obo. Please don't go anywhere. We'll be right back shortly. Finally, brethren, whatsoever things are true, whatsoever things are honest, Whatsoever things are just, whatsoever things are pure, whatsoever things are lovely, whatsoever things are of good report, if there be any virtue and if there be any praise, think on these things. Bless the Almighty God, give Him all glory. Give him all honor. Give him all adoration. Bless his holy name. He is worthy to be praised. There is no one like him. He is the Almighty God. He is our help in ages past. He is our hope for years to come. He is the beginning and the end, the Alpha and Omega. With all your heart, lift your voice to the Almighty God, for He is higher than the highest. He is greater than the greatest, better 
than the best. He is stronger than the strongest, wiser than the wisest. He is the Lord strong and mighty. Come and let's worship him, for he is the greatest man in battle, the omnipotent, omniscience, and omnipresent. He is the father to the fatherless, and the mother to the motherless. He is faithful and true, the Holy One from Biakban, the chief cornerstone, the good shepherd, the light of the world, love divine, the God of brotherhood of the cross and star, the King of kings and Lord of lords, His Holiness, Olumba Olumba Obu. Thank you so much for joining us once again. Uh, this is the second uh, session of this program where our phone lines are open for you to call us, share with us your testimony. Our topic for tonight is the power in the new name of God, Olumba, Olumba, Obo. In the new name of God, 
oh 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 so we want you to call us and share your testimony how you have applied this name and the name worked for you where you call this name when you call the name and the father answered you you can also share with us your problems be it spiritual or physical share with us your messages if you have dreams you cannot interpret you do not understand those dreams please feel free to call us and share with us and the father will attend to you also you can send your message via uh, live chat session uh, on our stackers television international youtube platform and we'll also read your messages all right so whilst we're expecting your call of course uh, we're going to treat one last question before we start uh, receiving call which is how can one use the name to experience its potency now we know that god is not limited to any place or to any time so how can we use this name and experience the potency is there a particular way you should call upon this name must you go on your knees to call on the name must you confess your sin before you call on uh, the holy name must you put your hands together before you call on the holy name must you go on white to call on the holy name so how can we call on his name and experience its potency please brother daniel in the name of the lord jesus christ amen. and the blood of the lord jesus christ amen. And forevermore. Amen. if you are approaching the throne of mercy the throne of god almighty you come with humility that's the first principle in christianity in every setting where god is where god's dwelling or god's presence is found now, in Brother of the Cross and Star, before you enter the Bethel, you should know that that Bethel is filled with angels. And the thing, people you don't see are there. So, God Almighty is there, His angels are there, then you humble yourself. Don't just go there and just behave anyhow, and then act anyhow. Don't go to the Bethel and just treat people as you like, because His presence is lavishly seen. Then, even in the Great Hall, all the spirits in the universe are physically represented. So you humble yourself. That is why I used to like the one before when they want to bow out, walk out, you see them bowing down quietly in reverence. You must give him obeisance. You must give him absolute respect because he is not your mate in your Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. When you want to call upon him, you don't go shouting. Even if you, you call his name in a low tone, he still hears you in your Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. When you call his name, don't 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 brag. He is a God of humility. When you are worshiping Him, don't do as if without you, nothing cannot work. Just give Him His due glory, Father. I worship You. Give Him all the best names. Most of the time, you, you can see, you can just meditate. Oh, most holy and everlasting Father, the ancient of days, the mighty, mighty, the beauty of God, the first begotten Son of righteousness, the the beginning and the end. Give Him all those names. Give Him. The Bible says he inhabits the praises of men. So the only thing you need to do for God that will make him happy is to just worship. And that is an act of worship. The excellent act of worship to just, Father, you are wonderful. You are God. Without you, I'm nothing. You, without you, I would have. Just giving that praises inside of you, he is listening. I just discovered that most of the time, you are talking inside your heart. And you see the Father will turn and look at your direction. That tells you that he's listening to what you're saying. He is not a human being. Don't just say that you just enter and just do this anyhow. He is, he is from heaven. Okay, let's take this call. Hello? Hello? Hello, Anna. Good evening, sir. Okay, please go on. Thank you for calling for your life. Hello, uh, I'm calling from Delta. Uh, Okay. Uh, it was my son. I have uh, a big shop, son, where I put food. Uh, uh, uh. Some of our, uh, those who are my Zambian patients, they went there and took the Christian man by the hand, start telling the man. Then one of my brothers took them to court, so we the court. So that's where I went to, but I was the boy can Okay, please can can you he said he has a farm 
where he put O O O in the front. The inscription O O O. Yes. Somebody stole something. See, the father works when he works mostly, especially when you are innocent. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. If you are innocent, just believe the father is going to handle it for you and you are going to win. Amen. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. But have you, have you specially paid a title of 200 Naira over this case? No, I've not paid. I want you to go to the battle and pay title, just 200 Naira. Complain this case formally to the father. Okay, sir. Yes. The, the moment you said this, in the, you complain this case to, to God and also pay this tithe, instantly Amen. the whole thing will change. Amen. In the name of the Lord Amen. Jesus Christ. Amen. And Amen. then it will be for your favor. Amen. Now and forevermore. Amen. But aside what, you, aside what you said, aside what you said now, Try and look for a little Sabbath to pray for you. Father, cancel dates for you. Amen. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. I don't know you, I don't know if I know you, but right now, I declare by the power of the Dalumba Lumba Buddha that dates that they sent to you in the next three weeks, Father, I've canceled it. Amen. In the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Any form of death, spiritual and physical, whatever death, by any means. As I'm talking now, Father, return it back to send Amen. Amen. Now and forevermore. Amen. Amen. Please, a little Sabbath should pray for you. Amen. Now and forevermore. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Father. Hello? Hello? Peace of the Father. Thank you for calling prayer line. My name is Nanjo from Gladys. Okay. Last time I called you for help, I see what the father has done in my life. Amen. Thank you, Father. It's no issue. There is something in my stomach, like storm, at my left hand side. That is why I so said, let me call so that you can um, help me. Okay. W what's your name? Sir? What's your name? My name is Nancy Okay. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. The blood of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Now and forever. Amen. Amen. We thank the Father immensely for answering the prayer of the first thing, the, the time you call us requesting for something, and we pray for you. Father has done it for you. Amen. And we believe that Father is going to do this one for you also. Amen. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. And in the morning, do you have the holy, the holy oil? Do you have holy oil? No. Okay. If you don't have holy oil, get a glass of water, keep it this night in the house with you. Put a little salt inside the water. In the morning, tomorrow morning, bless the water, sing some songs, about three songs, then drink the water. What is in your stomach will go away. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Father. Amen. Hello? Good evening. Thank you for calling prayer line. Hello? We can hear you. Good evening. Hey, yes, please go on. Okay. Yes, please go on. We can hear you, Abigail. Sorry? Please, please. I have prayed now, but if you talk to me, well, I don't have peace with people. They also have peace with people. You, you have, you have problem. I have prayed now. Okay. Pregnant. She's pregnant. You don't have peace. All right. I'll pray for you now. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. 
And then, where, where are you? Are you, are you a brotherhood member? Do you go to this church? Okay. I want you to on Saturday. I want you to on Saturday. I want you to look for children to also pray for you, if possible. Can you get, uh, can you have children to pray for you on Saturday? Saturday, on Saturday. Okay. If you don't have if you don't have children around you. You can look for one of our branch on Saturday morning, stroll to the, our branch, and, and you will see children that will pray for you. But for now, I will pray for you now. And cover something on your head. Cover something on your head. Look for anything and, and put on your head. Greatest doctor. The greatest doctor Oh, oh Lumba Is the greatest doctor Greatest doctor The greatest doctor Oh, my father Is the greatest doctor See the Ponde In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. I separate every form of. For your forgiveness, Lord. I am begging for your forgiveness, Lord. I have come with a remorse to my father. Please forgive me, my father. I am sorry, oh. Holy Sado. Daddy, I am sorry, eh. Holy Sado. Holy Sado, Holy Sado, do do. Holy Sado. Holy Sado. Holy Sado. Holy Sado. Do not look upon my sins anymore Sometimes I go astray I need you, Lord, to correct my path To lead me, Daddy, to do your will To do your will and only your will I don't want to sin anymore I don't want, I don't want to do those things you don't want, Papa Give me the strength to practice your gospel, Holy Daddy. Sado. My father, I am sorry. Holy Sado. My father, I am sorry. Holy Sado. My father, I am sorry. Holy
Okay, mommy. Mommy, uh, mommy uh, will you be free on no. will you be free on Sunday to be on fasting with us? Okay. If I even do these things, I cannot. Okay. I would like. I have your phone number here. I would like to talk to you on Sunday morning, and um, I want you to be on six to twelve fasting with us. But when we started this fasting, you have to get a pail of a pail of water that you have. The, like your bathing water should be in a pail, and be by the side of you, and the, then the drinking water will, be, will also be in a cup beside you. As we are going to pray in the when we are done by twelve o'clock, so you you'll be drinking that water in the by six o'clock. Then you are going to um, shower with the water around you, and the Father will take that thing away from you. Amen. Thank you, Father. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. So I got phone uh, your phone number, which I'm going to call you after after this program. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Thank you very much. Thank you, Father. Amen. Now forever more. Amen. Okay, so please, Brother Daniel. Yeah. You know, you were explaining how can we experience the potency of God. Yes, uh, the potency of God could also be especially seen when you call the name of God with faith. Most people say, oh, you call God, but what you are believing inside is a different thing. But we know what we have. Whenever I want to call the Father, I know that, number one, He cannot fail me. Have established that one inside your heart, that He is too faithful to fail. And then, call with authority. Most people, when you want to speak, there's a difference between you see maybe a satanic spirit hanging around, get up. And we look, come and get up from this place. There's that vibration. Speak with energy, speak with authority. When you speak with authority, evil spirit, fear. They know that you have something that you are not afraid. You walk majestically. Some people are so scared in life. You even it's more than you are afraid. How can you be afraid when you have he that wears the red garment? Do you know what it means to wear the red garment? That means he has sprinkled the blood of all his enemies in his, in his clothes. He said, the day of vengeance is in my heart. So that vengeance is, is avenging for all his children. So we have a father who is a warrior. When you want to call his name, call his name with authority. Great spirit Olumba. Great spirit Olumba. Great spirit Olumba. I am that I am. Give him all the good names, all the best names. That's why there's one song he gave me. The most excellent name to celebrate. Okay. Sorry. Yeah. Peace of the Father. Thank you for calling Prayer Life. Good evening. We can hear you. Yes, please. Go on. Yes, please go on. Go on with your message. Yes, I want to thank the Father and thank you for today's program. The greeting of the Father, what we have done and we've learned and look around. I have just two things to mention or three. Uh, it's almost, there was almost going to be a plane crash. I traveled. That was from Lagos to Calabar. That was many years back. I traveled from school. That was my first time of going to Calabar. I was thinking that one year back. So, for Kenya, I came from the United The plane was almost going to land in a very rough way. And then, the leap of the but when he told us that he was to make calm, that the father, he was with the calm of the father, he said, Father, have mercy. He told us this is silently saying that calling on the holy name of the father, but of how he was to be one safely into the world. There was no plane crash. And then the other terms of the 2017, almost were drowned. It was from Oron to Kalabar, and to the court. It was almost going to pass by. It could have been calling my own name. So we didn't have that. I just said, Father, have mercy upon me. We do a win. Father, have mercy. I want to thank the Father that the Father has never had done a lot, even during my studies here. I was almost kidnapped. But the Father appeared. I had to be a man that told me that he was a brother of mine. 
so much for calling thank you all right so the song the, the song the most excellent name to celebrate the most excellent name to call the most excellent name to treasure is his holiness Olumba Obu. <laughs> so i just thank god for that name because it is the best name to treasure yeah. the, the only excellent name to call call him in truth but most people are they, they love lying. You can't call him and you are lying, he will not answer. Because he is the spirit of truth. Call him with love, with forbearance, with a free mind. Most people are, are experts in blocking people's progress. When you stop those activities, when somebody buys Jeep, somebody celebrates something, be happy. Immediately you just say, Why should you be this person? As you are praying, he will not answer. Because you are you are grieved for somebody's progress. Yeah. And that is common in a in this very generation. So we pray the Father should give us grace to be contented with what we have and then appreciate what He gives for us Amen. so that our prayers will not be hindered us mm. in the name of Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Hello? Hello? Yeah, hello. Peace of the Father. Peace of the Father. Thank you for calling me. I don't want to share a testimony about the day of the day. Okay. Hello, can you hear me? Yes, we yes. can hear you. Yeah. Okay. Um, I have a house now, five years ago. So I, she did something wrong, and I asked her to leave. So by the time I came back, she has drunk a cup of sniper and tied in my kitchen. So I called that name. I remember that, yeah, I have a name that is more powerful. So I went to around the hotel and I call the president for the number of people three times. And a sniper. So what this only that have died, people are crying, people are were confused. The father brought her back to life. And the doctor the whole went to the hospital. They say no, she never never on the skin gave sniper. But when she woke up, she confessed to the police that she asked her to drive the sniper. So the name we bring Amen. And the Father will continue to, to remain your God. Amen. Yes. Amen. Thank you so much for Look calling. Look at the testimony. Yeah. Very powerful. That's yeah. the yeah. All right, so beloved, we are, please keep the calls coming. We need you to call and give your testimony, share your experiences, how you've applied the name of God, Olumba Olumba, and how it worked for you. Share this testimony, you know, to build up the faith of other brethren and also for you to have more testimonies. You've heard from our wonderful guest here. God delights in your praises. So keep praising Him, give Him that honor, thank Him, and He will do more testimonies you all right so let's take a comment here on our youtube platform we have the first comment here from john and tori says thank you father adebuka says thank you heavenly father remy ehigi at all thank you abu father chi living signature thank you father justice lamti thank you father kk thank you most merciful father abo elizabeth thank you almighty father gladys so yebo says great day of healing and breakthrough Thank you, most merciful Abba Father. Udo Uduak says, thank you, Father. Maurice Asiri says, thank you, mighty Father, for your grace and unconditional love upon my family. 
Augusta Nestor, thank you, merciful Father, for divine healing. Amen. Gemma James, thank you, Grace Abba Father, for another day of living, another day of life. Gladys Ayobo again says, absolutely correct. There is power in the new name of God Almighty. We are indeed the locusts of all generations to witness thy divine reign and glory. We have again from Gemma James says, Thank you, Almighty Father, for your love, and thank you, Papa, for your peace that surpasses all understanding. Father, we thank you for first loving us. Yes. We have MS All says, Peace, perfect of the Holy Father. Perfect peace of the Holy Father, sorry. Mansa Musa says, Thank you, Father, beginning to the end. Drenza Mona says, Thank you, Father, you are too much. Yes. Christian Ogago says, Perfect peace of the Father to you all. My sister had a dream where little children fetched water with two can for her, and she drank from it and kept it down, but one fell and the child started to cry she called her to tell her she called her that she will fetch more for her and she disconnected i don't know the meaning that's from christian ogiago saying how did you wait to kids fetch water for his sister it's a nice one okay a nice dream um let the sister expect something good and in the middle of this good thing, she has to have from the source that the good thing is coming. When one of the baby or the, baby, the, the two child fell down, eh, means that inside the help that is coming for you, there is a help that you will also do. You understand? God is giving you something. That thing is coming. But in the process, there is something that they want you to use that blessing to do. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. It's a nice one. Amen. Thank you, Father. Gemma, Christian Ogiago, I hope you've gotten the interpretation to that dream. So this dream um, brings to my uh, my notice. Someone actually shared a dream uh, with me. The person said she saw um, another sister, like a friend, mm. actually bathing a baby in the dream. Mm. She, the, the sister was happy bathing and that child, but the child was not the sister's child was somebody else either related to the person, but that was a dream. So, but she says she doesn't understand what that dream means. But let's take this call first. Hello? Hello? Yeah, good evening. Thank you for calling Prayer Line. Good evening. Peace of the Father. Yeah. Right, peace. Oh, okay. We've lost. So, um, I, I think another person child in your dream may not be too nice. May not be too nice. Um, but if it is this way, I'm thinking it is. Father, counsel it. Amen. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. It's, it's like glorifying something else, not your own. You see, every woman needs his own child. So, but it could also be a test to see if you can handle something if it's given to you. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. But if it is that way, Father will make it come to fulfill. Amen. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Now, now, a dream like that is in two ways. Is it good and is bad? If it is bad one, Father has counsel it. Amen. If it is a process of giving the sister a, a powerful gift, Father, I've granted. Amen. 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 Thank you, Father. Oh, we keep missing that call. All right. All right so we have from Mansa Musa says, "Family of God, in the name O O O, remember me in prayers. My employers always hold back on giving me my salary. Two weeks now, and they have not released my salary. I pray the Father have mercy. O O O. This is from Mansa Musa." Father, release the salary. Amen. Amen. And from this month, they will not delay your salary again. Amen. In the name of our Lord you, Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Musa Suleiman says, Brethren, peace of the Father. I want to thank the Father for this, his mighty hands upon my family. My company has refused to pay my salary till today, saying they paid it to someone else. I don't have anyone to complain to except the Father. Some weeks ago, the father said he was going to surprise me. Of the truth, 
I have seen it because he has been providing for me and my family without my salary. And I say, may the name of Olumba be praised now Amen. and forevermore. Amen. Amen. Yeah, I, I, it is not good for them to say that they are taking your, your salary to pay another person. Mm -hmm. You know, like I was explaining a few minutes ago with someone on the phone. When it is, when you see a spiritual warfare, sometimes Satan does not fight for you to know that it's fight. That is a battle that is going on. He will give you some inch and delay you in some time until he, he makes sure that he capture everything around you and pull them down before he will strike. Making sure that there is no money in your hand is not divinely arranged by the Father. You understand? But I command heaven today Amen. who will open that door. Amen. Anything that makes people to forget you, anything that makes it is time for you to benefit and things will stand up against you. Amen. Today, Father, I've counseled it. Amen. Father, I've also taken it away. Amen. Amen. To bring a everlasting joy and things will happen according to time. Amen. Now and forever. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Thank Father. You, Father. Hello? 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 Good evening. Thank you for calling Prayer Life. Yes, we can hear you. Hello? Hello, can you hear us? Okay, I'm barely hearing you now. I'm thinking of I have a question. This is just a call from New York. Okay. Can you hear me? Yes, we can hear you. Okay, I have a question. Where I stay, every night I see like a kind of a being that this is an animal. But then whenever I Okay. 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 I'm. 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 The message coming through what you're saying is, uh, is that there is a is there's a brother, that is monitoring you. There's a brother that is monitoring you, and Father will disgrace him. Amen. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. He's, he, has, he has the ability to turn to different kinds of uh, um, 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 Animal. um, animals and different kinds of beings. Uh, kind of. In fact, he has been able to enter your room as a walker before, running around. But I want to tell you, um, I want you to do this. And whosoever that will transform and turn to any animal will die like that. Amen. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Somebody is monitoring you and the person has a kind of doing, uh, has done something before this time to your body, to your armpit. But Father, I've returned those poison back to sender. Amen. Mm. Are you hearing me? Yes. Okay. No, I'm, I'm only hearing one or two words. I heard a brother done this. Okay, so I said that there is a brother who has ability to transform to so many things. Appearing that you are seeing now in your in your your, your physical eyes, you can see now. But I want you to now 
make use of this kind of prayer. It's a way of cleansing. Take a, a, a water into a bowl or like a plate. Pray over it. Sprinkle mm -hmm. in your house. Are you hearing me? Can you hear me? Yes, she can. Okay. Okay, you sprinkle your house. You do this for seven days. Seven evening. Like good seven evening. You sprinkle everywhere. Just a kind of sprinkling of water. You, you, you Then you make some pronouncement. Then you can read Psalm, uh, Psalm 951 and Psalm 6. Do this for seven days. Father will return whatever the brother, wherever he came from, he will go back to sender. Amen. And nobody like that will appear again Amen. in your house. Amen. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. I will also pray for you Amen. after this occasion. I mean, Amen. after this program, I will, be, I will be praying for you also on my own. Amen. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. I'm also sure Amen. that wherever he came from, Father will return it back to sender. Amen. Amen. The very brother that is turning Amen. to this thing will give you a phone call tomorrow. For you to know okay. who is the person I'm talking about now and forever more. Amen. Amen. Thank you for Amen. thank you so much for calling. All right, so back to our YouTube uh, platform. We have from Agbo Elizabeth, P perfect peace of our father. Last week Sunday, I had a dream where I was in the Bethel. Then I heard someone saying, "Okay, let's take this call. We'll continue." Hello? Hello? Peace of the Father. Thank you for calling prayer line. Hello? Yes, we can hear you. Move away from your radio. Or your radio or television. Hello? 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 Thank you for calling prayer line. Good evening. Hello? Good evening. We can hear you. Mm -hmm. Good evening. My name is uh, Juan Calodiel. Okay. I need the prayer. Okay. Okay. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. In the blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Now and forevermore. Amen. Amen. Amam onyen so onyen so onyen so na so amam onyen so de mema yimi oh amam onyen so onyen so onyen so na so amam onyen so Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Mighty Father, the Lion of the tribe of Judah, you are in everywhere at all times. Amen. Thank you, the sole spiritual head mm -hmm. of the whole universe. I don't know him. I don't know where he's calling from, but you are the quickening spirit. Yes. Amen. You are with him already. Amen. You are also here with us. Yes. Amen. Father, mm -hmm. you know him by his own face and name. Amen. You know his heart desire. Amen. You know what he's requesting for now. Amen. You know what he's passing through right now. Amen. But Father, thank you for shutting the mouth of the lion. Amen. Amen. Thank you for destroying the power of the wicked man. Amen. Thank you for setting him free Amen. and giving him testimony Amen. in the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Whatever that is standing against him through this prayer line, Father, return that evil back to sender. Amen. And correct his physical time and spiritual time together so that Amen. everything is touching can work. Amen. In the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. For any realm, in any realm that they have shifted this time and said nothing will ever be complete in your life and said nothing will, will, will ever be arranged in your life, I call the angels that can arrange his future to start work this evening. Amen. And by the time it is in the morning, Father, surprise shall take over his life. Amen. And fulfillment of the gospel of God shall take over his life. Amen. In the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. And all glory will be given to thy holy name for now and forevermore. Amen. The thanks and praises be given to the one that has put your enemy to shame. 
In the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Glory and honor be given to the one that has put your enemy to shame. In the blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Let the will of God manifest in your life for now and forever. Amen. Amen. Thank, Amen. Thank you, Father. Hello. Hello. Thank you for calling prayer line. Good evening. Peace of the Father. Uh, please, hello. Yes, yes, we can hear you. Hello? We can hear you, please. Hello? Okay. All right, so back to our YouTube platform. We have from Agbo Elizabeth saying, Be, uh, Agbo Elizabeth says, Perfect peace of our Father. Last week, Sunday, I had a dream where I was in the Bethel. Then I heard someone saying that BCS members have entered Cameroon. So with joy, I ran out of the Bethel to meet the BCS members to pray for Cameroon. After we finished on my way back to the Bethel, our CM called one of the brothers from Calabar to pray for me. And he called me a BM in that dream. When I entered the Bethel, I heard a voice saying to me, saying, do you know this is the second time they have tried to kill you? Then I said, no. The voice continued and said, the person trying to kill you is a woman. And he then, he said, the person trying to kill you is a woman. And he then opened a book and showed me where they had written my name and tried to kill me. Then I discovered that they had planned to kill me at 1030 two good times then i said so if i won't have attended these uh bcs then this could be the end then i woke up from the dream please i want the holy father to reveal to me this person trying to kill me please this is from elizabeth abo in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. The blood of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Now and forevermore. Amen. Amen. Some revelation given to us is for us to be able to know that God has already fight and conquer some of these battles for us. Amen. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. These are the reason why God is giving us some revelations. If God, Father wanted you to see the picture or the names of the person, mm. there is a book he has given you, it shows you your name. He would have shown you the, you know, the, the person that wanted to kill you, or he show you his face. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Because he has taken you to Cameroon, brought you back, taken you to the battle, and he was the one talking to you, mm -hmm. telling you that by 10.30, in two times, that they wanted to kill you. So I, 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 I think you should rejoice and be happy that Father have really revealed to you that your life was in danger, and then now you are safe in the name of Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. And go straight to the Holy Spirit, that person, and see how you can pray and thank the Father and pay your tithe and tell him thank you. Yeah. Mainly, you should know that at this point, that debt has returned back to send us. Amen. In the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Now and forevermore. Amen. Amen. The next comment is from Doggy Barra Hezekiah Berry says, The name Olumba Olumba was really powerful and it truly led me through my studies as a medical doctor. Mm, it's right. truly the new name of God as all spirits reverence it when it is mentioned. Thank you, Father. Yes. Thank you so much for sharing that wonderful testimony. Joanna and Tori says, There is mighty power in the name of OOO. I thank the Father for using his power to fight for us spiritually and physically. This power in his name have fought for me since I was baptized in 1984. We have here from MCO saying, Father passed through the PCS to testify on my behalf. I was stranded and needed a ride, and every car I stopped wouldn't stop. And out of nowhere, a car stopped and asked me to board it. This was OOO. Thank you, Father. Thank you so much for confirming that wonderful testimony. We have Queen Testimony says, I thank the Father for saving my life and soul in so many occasions. One day, His Holiness Olumba Olumba came through a dream with his red sultan. I was in a strong high tower surrounded with chains and he asked me to do as he does. Then he jumped and shouted hallelujah seven times and I did the same. As we were shouting, he broke every chain around that tower he alone can save and deliver. Thank you, Father. Thank you so much for sharing that wonderful testimony, Queen Testimony. 
we have here from Joanna and Tori says, Thank you, Father, my God, God of Joanna. Thank you, Father. We have here from Princess Money says, Another day I say, the holy of the holy standing in front of a pool at his right was his holiness Olumba Olumba Obu, and at his right behind him by the pool was the BM that baptized me into brotherhood. That's a wonderful uh, dream. Thank yeah. you so much for sharing that. Yes. Yeah. Musa Suleiman says, please, on behalf of my brother Ibrahim Musa, I'm pleading the father to make a way out for him for things are really tough for him. And also the white lady who's hoping on the father to heal her of her many illness. She has been thanking the father for her brother who was in coma. And now the father has set him free. Okay. I thank the father for not letting his name down. Mm -hmm. I thank, uh, okay. Okay, that's the answer. I thank the father for not letting his name down. Thank you so much, Mr. Suleiman, for sharing this wonderful testimony. I know the father has started the work and he's going to complete the work. Yes. We have from Grace Russell saying, Thank you, most gracious father, all oh, oh, the great God of the universe. Amen. Queen Testimony also says, Also, I thank the father as lately as I was feeling people entering my bedroom at night. Each time I called, oh, 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 they vanished. He yeah. always comes and rescues me. I thank you for your love and mercy. Let all glory and honor, majesty, adoration, and supreme mercy be ascribed to thee alone for now and forevermore. Amen. Amen. Peace of Baton says, the new name of God is so powerful. Whenever I call upon him, he answers. Thank you, Father. Thank you all so much for sharing your wonderful testimony, for your comments, for calling us. I believe you. This is where we draw the curtains close for tonight. Today, or rather tonight, has been has been very wonderful we have spoken on the power of the new name of god olumba olumba Ubu. thank you so much brother Meshach, for coming thank you so much brother daniel for coming and a very big thank you goes to the holy father his holiness olumba olumba Ubu, for yeah. granting us the privilege the inspiration for giving us those divine words of wisdom to explain to describe the power in his name olumba olumba Ubu. we believe and know that all the requests of the children of god all the prayers all uh, messages whatever we've placed before him through this program that in his name we have requested and he is going to honor his name and answer all our prayers for us so thank you once again for joining us i am Uduakakba. don't you have a lovely evening oh,